in Buddhist psychology, there is a meditation called the Zazen, which just means sitting meditation. But there is also a walking meditation called Kenhen. I think of skiing as a kind of highly immersive moving meditation. It is a profoundly immersive, multitasking, mind emptying experience. An ancient Greek once said that you cannot enter the same river twice. By the same token, you cannot ski the same slope twice because of the ever morphing landscape and topology of the slope. And that requires real-time presence and self-correcting feedback. You know, if we were sitting by a fireside, it would be a fireside chat, but it's a ski lift chat. Just uh, some trivial thoughts from, from a skiing psychologist. One of the things that I really appreciate about skiing is that is that it has built-in variability that takes us off the autopilot. The snow conditions vary, the terrain varies, the amount of traffic on the slope varies. So this is a profoundly immersive experience. In fact, if you're listening to music while skiing, which I think is a really great element of this pastime, you might notice that the music disappears when you're actually going down the hill. You pick it back up when you're back on the ski lift and you realize that there is sound in your ear. But uh, the music as such just kind of vanishes. It's eclipsed by the real-time moment-to-moment demands of the skiing challenge. And also what I think is really valuable about this pastime is that it is very self-corrective. Every time you run, you get some feedback from your experience. You either like it or not like it, or you like most of it, except for this or that moment. And then you go back on the same run and you try to do it just ever slow, ever so slightly differently in order to get an optimal experience, an experience that you like. And this is a habit that we oftentimes fail to develop, the habit of paying attention and correcting ourselves, the habit of listening to the feedback, particularly to the feedback of the body. So, as you ride the ski lift next time, think about this self-corrective magic, this self-attunement, this profoundly immersive experience that empties out your mind of all the thoughts and feelings and sensations and gives you this brief but so much needed reset. All right, I wish you well. Good runs to you.